here we've been most of the core parts of our structure, having obtained two of the most crucial connections. But then again, remember that all these connections should have been tested under the corresponding design loads, internal forces, shear and bending moments. Namely, advanced steel will somehow need of a third-party program, for acquiring the proper values and validate the connections. But let's continue, and place the remaining concrete footing. And once again, let's quickly skim through these options, since we won't realize any important modification. I'll just close this window. And with this new component now added, we might continue by copying these set of connections, to the remaining joints. So, let's start with this connection. Again remember, whatever change you perform, should be backed up by a proper analysis of the internal forces, shear and bending moments. Moving on, let's obtain then the missing connections.